I grew up here as a student, so I, I had the opportunity to come back as a teacher. Some of the reasons I came back, I think, are based on family. For, you know, parents looking at Burke Burnett, you know, that's one thing, is that their kids are gonna be treated like family. They're, they're gonna be talked to and they're gonna be looked after. And I think for me, family was and is a huge part of Burke Burnett and of course our school district. Good morning, everyone. It's a beautiful day in Burke Burnett, Texas. Today's high is 71 with a mild cold front coming in later this evening. We got a big game Friday night. Please everyone make sure you come out and support the team. And always remember, once a bulldog, always a bulldog. You know, education is an evolving thing. It's, it's constantly growing. And our job as a district is to continue to, to make sure our kids are equipped for a, for a world that's always changing. We make sure our students are happy and committed learners, and we make lots of sacrifices on our own part to make sure that happens. The fact that you have the opportunity each day to make a difference in their life, you know, whether it be to greet them in the morning or whether it be during the passing period, you know, it's really our job and our responsibility, but we don't look at it that way. I think we really have a true sense of family and community. I think that's a, a real thing that helps Burke stand out among a lot of other districts in the state is the ability for our board and our teachers and our community to see the vision of what education needs to do in order to meet the needs of our students. The community supports our what we what we do here and we, we are nothing without our community. Growing up here, the school district was unbelievable to me. You know, teachers that that I had that made a tremendous difference in my life. My daughter received a quality education, very quality education in Burt Burnett. She's had a successful first year in college, was able to clip out uh, many of her basics because of the advanced classes and the great teachers she had in Burt Burnett. Even teaching these little ones that I have that, you know, they can be something really cool, you know, something that hasn't even been made yet. They just sit there and you can see it like, wow, you know, and I try to instill that in them, you know, that it's more than just this room that I'm in, you know, for a day. If they want to go to college, we want to prepare them for college. If they want to go into the workforce, we want to prepare them for the workforce field that they want to be a part of. Our district has been very proactive in their approach to being on the cutting edge of education. Innovation without action is simply just something that you're doing. It's not really innovative until it becomes an action. And so we have innovative conversations about where and what we need to do for our students to create customized learning experiences for our students. From those conversations, we have to act and we have to take action on that. And we're in the process of doing that by supplying opportunities for our kids to um, touch on robotics, to touch on technology, to touch on our fine arts, to touch on our athletic stuff. My favorite thing as a teacher is when it finally clicks for a kid. It might be um, an advanced learner who has pushed himself or herself through the next hurdle or obstacle to reach something they thought was unobtainable. Or it might be a struggling student whose hard work and effort and determination have slowly but surely finally paid off. And then that is the only reward I need to keep coming back year after year. I've made a commitment a long time ago that when I moved into administration out of the classroom, I was going to make sure I greeted kids every morning so that I keep in my mind when I'm sitting at my desk and making those decisions for a district on the direction we need to go and sitting around a table collaborating with other educators and other leaders in the community on the direction Burke needs to go for our kids, that I have some individual student's face in mind because I saw him get out of the car that morning. I 
I love going to Bret Burnett ISD because there's a really good theater program and it's a good way to express yourself. It's very happy people here. The office is nice. I definitely push myself every day. Whoever wants to come here should come here. It's a great school. I love my school and I love to learn. Whether it be in a situation if we're talking about education or athletics or just the community in general, the idea that we're all in this together is truly in essence what Burke Burnett ISD is all about. And it's a complete team effort from our custodians to our groundskeepers to our bus drivers who greet the kids in the morning when they get on the bus to the last ones they see at the end of the day to say, hey, have a great day. It takes all of us and collectively we can handle it. We accept the challenge. Get to know us, spend some time with us, go online, but really come inside the district and find out what Berkman is all about. I just think Burke is, it's home. It's where you want to stay. You want to have your family here. You want to see what's next.